Well, my name is Carolyn Barry, and I've been doing this business, in this business, for a very long time. As an actress, I've done over 400 commercials. Uh, as a casting director, I have done casting for about, can I have a seat? For about 15 or 16 years now, and probably cast over five or 600 commercials, even though I don't really consider myself a full-time casting director. I do a couple dozen jobs a year for people that I know and like me and leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> and let me do jobs with actors because I don't like doing stuff where I don't get a chance to work with actors because that's what I specialize in. Since 1983, I have been teaching and I am considered one of the top uh, sole owned proprietor uh, teachers in town. I have a, a whole staff of people who work with me in my other workshops as well. But primarily, that's what I love doing the most. And I've been doing it since 1983, so obviously, if I'm still in business, I must be doing something right. <laughs> and, and I've changed. My, my whole approach has changed since I've been starting. And in 1983, when I first started, I owned my own casting facility. And for six and a half years, I had the largest training and casting facility in the country. It was called Professional Artist Group. It was over on Highland until I went quietly crazy and sold it in 1989 to a man who ran into the business. But needless to say. So anyway, so I, I, I have my own advertising agency. I, I've been a casting director for 16 years. I've owned my own, come, come, don't hesitate, come sit down. Uh, I've owned my own casting facility. Uh, I've been teaching. I've been a working actress. I directed a show off Broadway. So I'm fairly diverse in my knowledge of the business. And I consider myself sort of a, not sort of, be proud, Carol. I am sort of an expert in the area of uh, commercial audition. And in fact, just uh, six, seven months ago, I've now been asked to write, uh, be one of the contributing writers to the commercial break column in, at Backstage West. In fact, one of the, the article that I passed you out there was my initial article, which is what I'm all about. I believe that good commercial acting is acting. Good commercial auditioning is acting. And most people don't think of it. They think commercials, acting. I put the two of them together because I truly believe that as an actor, why throw out what you already know? Because most of the time people go in and they complain, I, I didn't feel comfortable, I, I don't know who was that in there inhabiting my body, what happened? And it's because you're allowing them to rush you in and out and take you out of your power, which is your training and your experience. Now you don't always have control over every audition. Sometimes auditions just purely, hello, slate, profile, profile, tell me a silly story, and that's it. That, then they're just looking for a type. But the moment you have a line, the moment you have a scenario to work on, you have the ability to use what you know as an actor. So my goal in the time that we have together today is to get you to totally shift how you see your auditioning for commercials, how you audition for commercials, how you look at auditioning for commercials. Okay? We all together so far? Okay, good.